two stars of the Northern Territory's top professional basketball team, with several basketballs and a portable hoop set in a parking lot, are helping the youngest residents of Darwin's Bagot community develop important life skills. Key points Timmy Duggan says referral programs help keep youth out of the justice system Timmy Duggan says diversion programs help keep youth out of the justice system Australia's Children's Commissioner says youth justice is in crisis Australia's Children's Commissioner says youth justice is in crisis Commissioner explores national reform principles hoops for health is run weekly the community to help young and atrisk indigenous people in NT set lofty goals build resilience and regulate their emotions a culturally safe environment it helps kids stay motivated and get things done said Vale Mina White a community leader who came to watch her granddaughter play the program has also been funded since 2016 to work with children in the Don Dale and Alice Springs youth detention centers in the Northern Territory where more than 90 percent of detainees are indigenous Vale Mina White says the program gives kids a purpose and something to do. Founder Waramungu and Nayakina man Timmy Duggan OAM said many of the children inside are dealing with acute trauma or the intergenerational trauma of stolen generations, something he himself has experienced. Intergenerational trauma affects everyone, if not most, Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander families in Australia because of what happened to the stolen generation and all that stuff. We think that if we can give someone the tools to deal with this using our model, then we can make some impact there. Timmy Duggan says detainees don't get enough support. Mr. Duggan said youth detention centers were not equipped to provide the support they needed. For that young person to thrive and heal, the system and entire community needs to be there, he said. International evidence shows that by imprisoning children, they are very likely to return. Youth Justice System in Crisis National Commissioner for Children and Hollands believes that very few young people across the country have access to early intervention and referral initiatives like Hoops for Health. And while youth crime has made national headlines in recent months, it has been conducting a major investigation into national reforms to the youth justice system, which it says is in crisis. The treatment of children in youth justice is currently one of biggest, if not the biggest human rights violations in country, he said. And Holland says Australia's youth justice system is in crisis. He said official reports showed children being held in solitary confinement in some jurisdictions, a practice he described as incredibly harmful. In recent months, youth crime in Alice Springs and other parts of the Northern Territory has prompted calls for action. In Queensland, the alleged of a Brisbane mother on Boxing Day L.